Vendors at the Bat Friday Market were last Friday relocated to a more suitable vending tarmac by the Bat Woodley Park NDC. Details in this report. Vendors at the Bat Friday Market were last Friday relocated to a better vending tarmac by the Bat Woodley Park NDC. According to reports, the vendors previously occupied a space that was not fit for the purpose of marketing groceries to customers. Thus, a decision was taken by the NDC to relocate the vendors to the new location. A few of the vendors expressed satisfaction with the decision that was made, while a few of them shared unfavorable responses. How do you feel being here? That, comfortable, that better, comfortable, yes, because when the rain falls and sun and have the low side of the road when the breeze blows, when the car them pass, the big truck, the Mali Santa fly. So the place is comfortable, but the people them just not settle down. So the vendor them, if the vendor them settle along the market, they'll be okay. The people start coming and to their first day. To their first day. Uh -huh. So you feel happy being here? Yeah. Yeah, but just some piece of spot. Just a spot? Spot, yeah, oh. just a spot. Well, this is the first day. And yes. we don't know what the day may bring forth, but we just begging God that today be a blessed day for us. Our first day should be happy. Should be happy. Okay. How do you find the environment? Well, the environment is, is nice. It's nice. Only the cooperation. Well, I'm starting here for another share. Then everybody come and take their own thing. And when we come and take every the troll, we stand this morning. And this is food, but we must do this food. Garbage it? Food supper so therefore the cadaver come and the sanitary. So we see them tell her that and the chairman tell her that when Mila and other festival um thing they hear we can't move and we stand but that's right because one man show can't move and stand like this. I mean if put in, if you and your wife are selling your wife are selling you can't stand. So we tell them that can't work, no, no activity can't keep it. We agree to that. They don't agree to no activity. No activity we agree to. The God is on justice. Two man can't move and stand like this. Just stand at 15 feet, two can move on. But how do you feel the environment today? Well it's not too bad for first out in and we are um, glad to see what's going on. Later it might be better or worse or something, but we gotta try it with it. But the time is that we can't move no stand, we sell and we have it. Chairman of the Bath Woodley Park NDC, Mr. Nizam Bikram, was on site at the market on Friday and made these comments with regards to the issue. One of the things that we look at since we get into office, uh, we plan to remove the people from a, a bad state or a bad situation whereby they dump in garbage. Uh, all around the market and when the rain fall and animal pigs are getting the in the market and um, the tarmac is available so we decide as a council that we'll um, give them notice to move to this market and the response is very good very good excellent um, we make the toilet available we slash we make it tidy so that they may be able to be comfortable here for a long while the residents had previously stated that they were told in the event that cultural activities were planned, they would have to remove their stalls from the location. To this, the chairman said, So far, we're going to deal with that on a, a later stage, but for now, no. We're going to use it for market. And, now, and hopefully in the future that it will actually move from a, a, a Friday market to a daily market. Daily market. Yeah. Um, there will be any free consult to this um, vendor? Um, yes, because um, we gonna need the toilet to be clean, we gonna need the garbage to be collected. So we'll put the fee just about $200 per spot, which okay. is actually um, reasonable. So we're able to make it. Uh, will be implemented? Uh, we give them two-week grace. Two-week grace? So. Two-week grace. So after that, we'll take a fee which they actually agree to. The vendors generally expressed satisfaction with their new location and are looking forward to continued support from the public. Sasha Ramsaran reporting for Channel 8 News.